Hey everybody, it's Connie. Thanks for joining me today. I know you guys have heard of the three packet roast, and I'm going to make a three packet roast, but it's not the three you think. Okay, so let's get started on this yummy roast. First of all, this is not the three packets that you're probably accustomed to seeing in other videos. Um, I've variated mine just a little bit, and I've always cooked mine this way, and it's turned out yummy. So I wanted to share it with you guys today. Now, normally, I buy a chuck roast, and when I got to the store, I didn't have one. So I have a top round roast, and what I've done, since it didn't have just a whole lot of fat running through it, I have taken a fork. And I have beat it on both sides really well, stabbed it with my fork, and I've put some meat tenderizer on it. So what we do next is I am going to sear it in my pan here on both sides just for a minute or two to kind of pack in some of the juices. Yes, I am going to do this the old school way this time. I have done this recipe in my crock pot. And you can also probably do it in your Instapot and it'd be so fast and quick. So my meat is searing here and I hit it with a little pepper on both sides. And um, I think you're going to find that this roast is going to be plenty seasoned with what we're going to put on it. Now, I'm going to link a description uh, to the beef tip that I did oh, a week or so ago or maybe 10 days ago that you guys absolutely loved commented and you shared what you had made with it and you made them and loved them and i appreciate that um but this is going to be pretty similar to that so now that this is seared really well and i think those are looking pretty good okay so let's get this out and put it in my roaster here and it's really beautiful on both sides. If you can see that, I'm gonna put it right there. Now, I'm going to leave my renderings right here and I'm going to add a cup of water to this. And I am going to scrape the bottom of my pan just a little bit and kind of get that incorporated in my water. Okay, and now I'm going to add one packet of brown gravy and I'm going to sprinkle it over my roast like that and one packet of Lipton onion soup mix now these two ingredients they are actually in the three packet roast that you see everywhere but mine what I do for my third one is I add ranch dressing Instead of the Italian dressing, I add the ranch. Um, I didn't have a packet, so I'm adding one ounce of ranch dressing to my mixture here. And I'm just going to pour that over top of that. And I still have my water here in my pan. And I'm just going to kind of give that a little bit of a mix here in my pan. And I'm going to pour my juice over this roast. Just like this. And that's going to make a beautiful, delicious gravy for you guys. And I really hope that you will try this. But when we come back and I have this roast all done, I'm going to show you how yummy it is. I'm going to wrap it with my foil and cook it in my oven, probably for about an hour and a half on 350 degrees. Okay, you guys, my roast is out of the oven. I cooked it for about an hour and a half. And look at this beautiful roast with this beautiful gravy. And what I'm going to do is probably add a little bit of water to thin my gravy out, but I'm going to cut into it and show you how beautiful this three packet makes this roast so, so very good. So very tender. I hope you guys will try this and enjoy it as much as we do. I know my husband can't wait to have this tonight. I hope you go share the love. Tell somebody you love them. Until next time.
Bye.